What do we got? Rexar, Mouth, Triple Mage. Cool. And they have Rexar. <laughs> what is up with double Rexar suddenly? There's no Rexar all day long, and you pick it, and then there's one on the other team. Anyway, I don't mind mirrors, but just funny. So double Rexar, Tassadar, and then triple Backlane. We have triple sustained damage, and we have double burst and one sustained damage. But their hammer, if he specs into ambush focus attack, he's pretty bursty as well. No, I know. Quick matches RNG as well. It's, it's not you win, therefore he's a good hero. I know that. I'm just having a bit of fun with it also. Quick match does not try to give you mirrors. That's a, that's a myth, if anything. All it does is try to match support teams to support teams and warrior teams to warrior teams. Uh, what should I take? Flare. Block. Our paths converge. <laughs> Hunter Gatherer. I've tried playing without Hunter Gatherer. It's no fun. Hear me, Really? It does favor Mirror? Oh, that's a surprise to me. Sergeant Hammer, melee assassin. Keep it up, healer. I did not expect to live. Thank you, base mouth. Misha. <laughs> Oh, Misha died for one regen blow. I've got the scent. I'm gonna heart that. I must heal. You look like you need Ooh. a visit to the healing fountain. Okay, ten seconds. I'm gonna go straight for the immortal. What? I have fifty siege damage. Did I misclick? Um, one Misha auto attack. Let's move. Poor Misha, man. This is animal cruelty. He should come work for me. Man, they're doing more damage. Oh, it's their hammer. I'm acting on instinct. Misha, here. Warriors to me. Oh, my God. Close. Now that you wrecked me, any advice to improve my Lunara play? Were you, were, uh, were you Lunara against Rainer, Lisbeth? Or, oh, the Rhaegar game. Man, I don't know. I wasn't paying attention to that. Um, I'll get easy prey. Oh shit, it doesn't work against monsters. That sucks. So it has no value for, for the reason I picked it. What the hell? This this hammer took uh, the healing. No. He took... No, he didn't. Oh, 
What, what am I saying? It's leeching plasma, of course. I was like, why did he take vigorous assault on hammer? Nice. My eyes are upon you. Hear me, brother. I wander alone. Stick him. Make sure I don't kill. I needed that friend. Here. Make sure I kill. No. I must reach. Okay, don't come work for me. I'll get uh, aspect, more stance. Hammer's always gonna outtrade us if we're like late, like I was just now. I'm acting on instinct. Did I chase too far? Maybe. But I had to do it, right? Where is Hammer? Oh, we got it. Nice. Now I'll have your regen globes. Got him. I needed that friend. Okay, very good, very good. I'm definitely gonna go unleash the boars. It's the better one in general. Think about. I mean, think about that bestial wrath. It's 12 seconds. It's slightly longer than Steam Pack and Bloodlust. Both are incredibly unpopular because of how easy it is to disengage out of them. Oh, come on, Nisha. Your killing spree is is mine. That should have never ever happened. What a niblet I am. <laughs> that Nazibo has been way too aggressive all game, but gotta hand it to him. He went through hell hell and back again. <laughs> he got outplayed. Even a level up. The wild. So be it. Yeah, I got outplayed. I should never have lost that. Yeah, don't grab it yet. Unleash the beast. Misha, here. Our paths converge. 
Surge. Mission, join me. Oh, they're taking our camp. They're taking the hobbits to Isengard. Well done all. Stick to my side. Misha, kill. On the prowl. Right in the face. Right in the face. Oh, it's mano a mano again. <laughs> wow. Really? You went for orbital orbital BFG on this map? Which never gets to late game. So orbital BFG or BFG I should say is terrible until level 19 and then it gets awesome at level 20. This get, this map usually ends quite fast. I hear the call of the wild. Anyway, it killed me and that's what matters. Outplayed. Track them down. Misha, kill. Misha. Wow, super stuns. My thanks. Sick him. The path is long. Misha, kill. Sick him. The path is long. I'll get wildfire bear. <laughs> Gathering power in Azebo with blood ritual. Oh my god. I outplayed myself. That was a bad timing, actually. Oh my god. Blood Ritual on Battlefield of Eternity, where you are never spending any time in the lane. He gets a lane sustained talent. <laughs> Oops. You don't know where that's but I still die to him. Finally got him. And still I feel like he has the upper hand on me. The path is long. Converge. We're sixteen. Misha, kill. Misha, here. 
What do I get? Pain death. There's Nazebo again getting his gathering power stacks on. Oh, I wonder what he took at 13. Dead rush. His build is still better than my active bow build at the start of the day. This way. Yeah, Chromie is not that balanced against no cleanse. Temporal loop. Kill after secured kill. But she still needs a good frontline to uh and a healer. If she's against Nova Terra Illidan, it's not quite as fun for her. And you never know in quick match. Unless you five match your group of course. I live? Wow, that's some quality ice block. I have never gotten more value out of Fain Death than right then and there. Not even once. In fact, if I group up five of my average Fain Deaths, I will still not even dare or hope to aspire to the value of this single one. I got a four-man stun, did not die, and everybody on enemy team died. So sick. What is this evil doing here? Farming stacks? I feel sorry for our enemy team. Gathering power in Nazebo, no bueno. Well, that's the weirdest Misha charge I've ever seen. The force wall, the concussive blast. Not, not a surprise that OP hero like Rexar gets an immediate victory. Zebo wants it's an easy kill, saw you on Rexar. <laughs> Maybe he thinks gathering power is the more you die, the more ability power, kind of like a Gul'dan trait thing. He still had top damage, so there's not much you can say against his playstyle. So easy prey was a mischoice. I should have taken the mana return farther flying bird or the more slow bird. I mistook myself to imagine that this works on monsters. Immortal is counted as a monster and is not included. Monster only included in things like all enemies. So I did not get bonus damage on the immortal and they fixed that same thing with Lunara's nature scaling but I forgot. Whoops. Nice. Any advice for a Rexar beginner? Mm. Yeah, try to not fight too much with Rexar. Just focus on Misha and keep Rexar more safely. Rexar's damage is pretty okay, but his survivability is not so good. So either, like if the enemy has a dive team, keep Misha and Rexar close together so Misha can save Rexar. If the enemy does not have a dive team, mostly only attack warriors with your Rexar and keep Misha to do whatever else a tank would normally do. But you don't want to have a huge distance between Rexar and Misha if the opponent has someone like Illidan, Nova Zera, uh, someone who can jump on you, Kerrigan. 
and always get Fain Death if you are if you're not sure just get Fain Death it's uh, 5 seconds Misha controlling 35 second cooldown ice block it is level 16 but that's one of the best ice blocks ever Now this doesn't say non-heroes, this says minion and merc, which is a smaller categorization than non-heroes. Non-heroes is including monsters, but this doesn't. Why is Boris the better alt? Bestial Wrath is a 12 second bonus damage Misha hit on a melee character. And then you have uh, Lieutenant Morales, which is a uh, 10 second Huge attack speed increase as well as movement speed increase. And you've got Rhaegar's Bloodlust, which I think lasts for 8 seconds. Oh, 10 as well. 40% attack speed for a whole team, 30% move. And yet, Stimpak and Bloodlust almost never get picked. Because generally, you turn it on, opponents will disengage or lock down the target that has it. Now, it's not the same with Misha per se. But. Rexar is a warrior, which also means tank, which also means initiation and um, crowd control effects. It's the reason why Johanna always never went for Falling Sword, because it doesn't stun, but Blessed Shield does. Yeah, but Falling Sword, at least if it doesn't stun, it still interrupts. And also, it does a lot of damage these days, it got buffed. But it's all at once. And you can dive together with an Illidan or something. But Bestial Wrath does nothing except bonus damage. So it does have value like kill the boss faster. Um, really immobile fights. It can get value. Or if you have like double triple warrior. And you need more damage. You'll take it maybe. But generally speaking. Unleash the boars. Will hit the entire enemy team. Slow them for 5 seconds. 40%. That's amazing. Almost same cooldown. It can. It has so many different purposes. Bestial Wrath doesn't. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Nature's Culling works on Immortals. Yeah, sorry about that. Is uh, I was confused with the level one Cruel Spores change. Cruel Spores is Minion and Merc. It used to say all. Yeah, I messed that up with uh, Nature's Culling. Nature's Culling still works. Yes. <laughs> it's what I do. No problem. <laughs> These are my favorite kind of games. <laughs> I'm glad I got to experience this. If you experience this feeling once in your life, consider yourself lucky. Ah! No! Okay. Once in your life, like I said, it was too much karma. Too much good karma for one person.